Hey guys, this is uh, B16 and today I'm going to give you guys a preview of the Team Win Recovery Project 2.0. So let's go ahead and go into recovery. As you can see, there's the nice cool splash screen that we got. Now, one thing to know is that this is completely different from anything anyone's ever seen before. Their goal here was to make security and feeling secure the top priority. There's also features that are not included in this build due to them still working on it. But this is the HTC Thunderbolt and here we are. As you can see it's watermarked as the RootsWiki preview build. So let's go ahead and uh, check it out. As you see up top it says Team Win Recovery Project 2.0.0 based on the Android system recovery. Um, it shows the time. Um, as you see you got a few options here. So let's go ahead and go to install. So if you wanted to install something, you are actually able to use touch capabilities to go ahead and pick what you'd like. So say we wanted to install the G apps, all you'd have to do is press the flash button once you touch it. So we're not going to flash anything right now because our phone is set exactly how we need it right now. So let's go ahead and go back. As you can see, you can go to wipe. Go to wipe and you can choose between battery stats, Dalvik cache, cache, factory reset, and rotation. So, wipes complete for rotation. Let's go ahead and go back. Now, you can also go into the restore, and once again, it has a touch interface. Um, we only have one backup on this phone at the time. So, if you wanted to, you could scroll through, choose which ones you want. Let's go ahead and go back and see what else we got. Your backup works the same way except they have a checkbox system instead of a check it's an X you just click it boot there you go so you can choose what you want to back up um, this one has got a setup for a Wemax partition if you would like to back up your Wemax but since we don't have it don't worry about it um, I think that's pretty much it as far as what you can see um, Right now, like I said, there's a lot of stuff that it isn't available for it yet because they're still keeping it under wraps. They have a lot of cool stuff going on. Agribren and Shift and Eyeballer and Shinzel, a lot of these guys are putting in a lot of time and effort. I mean, there's numerous guys on this team, and it's a great team. Uh, so I can really expect nothing but greatness from these guys. Um, it is a great alternative to Clockwork Mod. Clockwork Mod is obviously the industry st standard these days in modding and hacking, but these guys, I feel, have what it takes to uh, be considered, you know, the top dog in the recovery business. So let's uh, let's see what we got coming from these guys. We've got some cool stuff coming up, and we hope you enjoy what you see. So let's go ahead and go to reboot, and we will reboot to the bootloader. There you go, team win. Enjoy.